All right, so first off, I want to thank my man, Lizzie, for coming all the way down from Fort Myers, Florida. When he hit me up on IG, I was like, where are you at? He said, I'm in Florida. I'm going to send you the dog. I'm like, all right. And we've dealt with a lot of people. They talk and they, they say they're going to do this and they say they're going to do that. And he was like, where am I sending the money? And he sent the money. I'm like, all right, I guess he's serious. Yeah. So why did you decide to come all the way to Texas to get your boy trained? Oh, I take it out to pay and stuff like that. And, you know, you like one of me, so I would like I assume that you. Yeah. And nah. he's a seven, eight-month-old little Malinois. He's still going to be learning, going through everything. But how do you feel about handling him initially? You talking about before I said that? Yeah. Rough. <laughs> <laughs> he was rough. He was rough. He was nipping people, biting people in the butt he wasn't supposed to. And now he's been around the kids, been around us. He's still excitable. He's still a puppy. But what do you think about him now? Yeah, he's good. Obedience level all the way up. <laughs> Whole reversal. <laughs> and then we're going to continue to build his protection side as he grows up. He's a minor right now, so he's still learning that fundamental, what it takes to be a working dog. And we're going to be down there in May, and we're going to put some more work in with him. Yeah. So I appreciate it. Stay in touch. It's a boys. Stay sharp, my friend. Ah, a lot of.